out, we're back outside, trying to take advantage of some nice weather before it disappears for winter. Now we've just come through August and those of you that are in sales or in the tech space will sympathise with me where you know that August can be a really quiet month. The holidays across Central Europe eat up a lot of your diary and it's impossible to coordinate with people. So we decided to pivot our tactics a little bit and focus on prospecting. The goal for us at the end of that month was to have a busy diary in the last week of August moving into September and I must say the team knocked out of the park. We've been back to back for the last couple of weeks and really enjoyed being back talking to prospects, understanding what problems they are facing in the markets. Now they've come back with the same sort of pain points that you would expect moving into the end of Q3. Uh, I'm under pressure to hit my pipeline target. Uh, I'm not going to get recognised revenue by the end of this year. And while these pain points might be relatively generic for our teams, the reasons behind them are often different. Um, people, maybe it's to do with their sales structure, maybe it's to do with unrealistic targets. The key element that stood out from all of these conversations was flexibility. Our clients need flexibility in how we approach them and offer them solutions. And we need to be flexible in what we're trying to deliver for them. So that means flexibility in communications, just understanding what the problem is, what they're trying to achieve and how we can support them to do that. Maybe that needs flexibility in how we structure a campaign. What, what market are we looking at? What regions are we operating from? Are we in Europe? Are we in America? Are we in LATAM? We also need to be flexible in terms of our pricing. We've started to mirror the market in this in terms of their commitment and we've, we've started to build out pilots, build that trust with our clients, build that alignment, show that we can support them and help them reach their pipeline and revenue targets. So this approach has led us to be all over the map now. September's been busy, but we've got two, two and a half weeks left until the end of quarter. And what we've decided to do is go out, meet our clients face to face, shake their hand, hash these deals out with them, get them over the line before Q3 for them and for our teams. So by the end of this month, I will be in Phoenix, I'll be in Dublin, I'll be in London, and I'll be in Stuttgart. So if you're anywhere near any of those cities, drop me a message, drop me an email, I'll come and see you, see what we can work out before the end of Q3, moving into Q4.